Compassionate Entrepreneurs, it's Erin Woods, and today I wanted to share with you about a mindset shift. Instead of thinking, what if, what if we started to think, even if? Now, I didn't come up with this on my own. I read it in a great book, which I highly recommend reading great books because they can help you along your journey. And this is from a book called Hustle by Joshua Medcalf. He also wrote Chop Wood, Carry Water. Highly recommend both of these books, amazing. So a lot of what we do in this business involves challenging ourselves and pushing ourselves out of comfort zones into action, right? Like you step out of the comfort zone and then you gotta do something. And there's a lot of voices and things that hold us back, telling us, well, what if I look stupid? Or what if I fail? Or what if somebody says no? Or what if somebody doesn't wanna shop with me or host with me? Or what if I feel foolish? What if I get embarrassed? I'm sure you have felt these things, I have felt these things, um, but what if we shifted that question, instead of asking what if, what if we asked even if? Even if I end up feeling stupid, even if I get a no, even if nobody buys anything, even if nobody shows up at the party, even if all of these things that I'm worried about actually come true, I'm going to be fine or I'm going to make the most of it, or I'm going to be thankful that I was able to drive to this person's house and set up a party and then help her feel good about what did or didn't happen at that party. Even if the worst thing I can imagine happens, I'm still gonna be okay. And what I love about this mindset shift, to be careful saying that, is that it puts you automatically into a place of gratitude. And being in a place of gratitude automatically diffuses anxiety and fears and things that could hold you back. Uh, because you're thankful for just the opportunity to make the phone call, the opportunity to have the time to sit and make 30 phone calls or send out messages or offer the beautiful opportunity that you have in Trades of Hope. Just thankful that you have this business. And so being in a place of gratitude diffuses those fears and anxieties instead of asking what if ask yourself even if even if this doesn't go the way that I plan I'm still gonna be okay I'm still gonna have a roof over my head I'm still gonna have a family and on and on and on all the things that could you know the worst things that you could possibly imagine will probably not happen even if you get that no and remember the, the answer is always no unless you ask so keep stepping out of that comfort zone into action and don't ask yourself what if ask yourself even if